Off the coast of East China's Jiangsu province is the country's first offshore wind power project with foreign investment. The Dongtai wind farm is more than 40 kilometers from here. When it was built in 2019, it was China's farthest offshore wind power project. It was also one of the most difficult ones to build due to water conditions and frequent typhoons. But the operators say the farther from land, the better the wind resources are. The project is jointly developed by China Energy and French energy giant EDF Group, one of the largest producers of low carbon energy worldwide. The project is expected to generate 1.4 billion kilowatt hours of electricity each year. According to estimations, that means we can avoid burning about 420,000 tons of standard coal and cut about 930,000 tons of carbon dioxide emissions. China Energy is the world's largest coal producer, as well as the largest thermal power and wind power company. It has also entered China's national carbon trading market that opened on Friday. The launch of the national carbon trading market will help us realize our carbon neutrality goal. China Energy is vigorously promoting green energy and its large-scale development. Guohua Energy Investment is one of the main parts of China Energy's clean energy sector and aims to increase investment in and development of clean energy and build more such projects. And as Liu pointed out, the motivation behind such efforts is China's goal of achieving carbon neutrality by 2060. Uh, I believe uh, carbon neutrality by 2060 is uh, an important uh, ambition, but it's uh, really worth uh, having it. And I think it's possible. It's possible through bold uh, action. On the one side, uh, developing more uh, electricity for the Chinese uh, economy, uh, but on the other side, uh, China will need lower carbon uh, electricity, which means uh, gradually get rid of uh, coal and uh, replace uh, existing uh, coal with uh, low carbon uh, technologies. Experts and industry professionals say wind power still faces challenges, including high costs and unstable weather conditions. But it's worth watching how clean energy can help China achieve the goal of carbon neutrality.